joy, happiness, right? So some sub forms here, gratitude, cheerfulness, relief. Now I, I want to focus on the body sensations and I want to show you how the body sensations connect to the behavioral reaction. So body sensation, lightness, expansion in chest, behavioral reaction, grab hold, hold on, repeat experience. So in other words, here's the example I always share about this. I've got two nieces who I, I love dearly, Reese and Paige. I have other nieces and nephews I, I love as well, but these are the little kid ones. So I get to, you know, be the syrupy uh, uncle um, with, with them. When I see Reese and Paige, and they live in Dallas, actually they're moving to the Houston area and we're super excited about that, but right now they live in Dallas. So when I see them, and sometimes it's been months since I've seen them, when I see them, what happens? I mean, I can feel it right now, just thinking about it. I want you to sit there for a moment. I want you to think about seeing someone who brings you great joy, who you haven't seen in a really long time. So it's a reunion, okay? What do you feel in your body when you imagine seeing that person? Okay. What I feel is this open, it's like this opening in my chest, this lightness, this opening in my chest. Now think about what that would have me do. I'm going to back up my chair actually. So you can see, come here, recent page, this cavity opens up and it just longs to be filled with you. And so I embrace you. I hold on to you. All right. That's the behavioral tendency, the action tendency or behavioral reaction to joy. See how the body sensation drives the movement there. That's joy. That's a pretty easy one. Most of us are pretty familiar with that. Let's talk about love. So here we might be talking about affection, connection, adoration. Okay. Warmth here, a swelling in the chest made me want to give, to offer. It's like it's radiating out. And so there's this outward, this reaching in an outward way, like giving of self, moving closer, wanting proximity and love and joy. Notice how similar they are and why it might be that we feel them simultaneously so often. That is love.